Turn to Ogun State, where uh, one person has been confirmed dead and another seriously injured due to a gas explosion at the Olusha Gumbasajo Presidential Library Complex in Abeokuta. The incident, which occurred at about 11 a.m., was the second explosion in 48 hours in the state capital, and the management of the facility has called for investigations into the matter. Kazimo Lowe has details. At least more than four persons have lost their lives in gas explosion in Abeokuta in the last one week, and this is the second explosion in 48 hours. This time, one person was confirmed dead and another seriously injured. The management of the Olusheg Mwabasonjo Presidential Library through the press statement issued by the managing director of the OOPA Ventures, Vitalis Otse confirmed that the explosion occurred when a pair of technical vendors were conducting routine servicing of the air conditioning units. The managing director also confirmed the death of one person and efforts made to curb the spread of the explosion and how they have rescued another injured person. The police and other security and emergency officials were also out to inspect areas affected by explosion in the last one week. Uh, the state government is worried and uh, that is why uh, the governor has directed that uh, we should uh, launch investigation to deter into uh, the incidents of uh, frequent uh, uh, gas uh, explosion that we have uh, witnessed uh, between the theft and uh, today, uh, within eight days, we have had about four, four explosions, gas explosions. So we want to really uh, find out the cause, uh, whether it is it's coming from human error, or whether it is an adulteration, or whether there's anything technically wrong about it. And that is why we have assembled a technical team comprising uh, the police, uh, the fire, the DSS, the Director of, uh, Directorate of uh, Petroleum Resources, uh, and the IEODs, uh, we also our who will involve the uh, uh, Miss Sun, that's a um, what do you call it? Standard, Standard, Standard Organization of Nigeria members to, 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 to join in the investigating uh, this, uh, the causes. This is an accident, one accident too many. And it is so within the space of about a week, we are recording four incidents with serious casualties. Residents were urged to continue to adhere to safety rules while handling highly inflammable objects at home or while at work, and the police and other security team are currently investigating what led to the situation. Kazimoloi, TVC News, Abeokuta.